These are some of the foldables in the big biology foldables by Tang Star Science. Now they come in two orientations, either horizontal like this one or vertical, depending on what made the most sense for the different um, topic. The foldable that you see right before you is three pages, and all of them are going to fold so that when they do, they fit neatly into a binder or an interactive notebook. In this case, in the binder, it doesn't impede the binder rings. The first one's an animal cell, and of course, that wouldn't be complete when teaching cells if you didn't have the plant cell. And then here's leaf structure and chloroplast. This comes as a three-page foldable or just a two-page foldable with just the leaf structure if that's all you want to teach. This is the flower. It comes in a three-page foldable that includes the flower and the pear to show how the structures of the flower become parts of a fruit after the flower has turned into a fruit or it comes as a two-page foldable with just the flower. This is the cell membrane, and you can use this as a two-page foldable, just sh showing the cell membrane structures, or as a three-page foldable, showing the function of the different membrane proteins. Then here's a large graphic organizer that shows the different branches of membrane transport, passive, active, and all the ones in between. This one is the teeth. It shows all the different teeth uh, types, and then it shows a larger structure of just the tooth structure itself with a cross section here. Here's the spinal cord and vertebral column. This one's the female reproductive system. And this one got a little frisky and decided to fill it out. <laughs> so it shows you both the uterus and what's going on in the ovary, as well as the different stages of uh, blastocyst and embryo formation. Oh, going in this way. Here's the urinary system with both the overview and the kidney. This is the neuron. This is the synapse. Here's a two-pager, and it's the heart. The brain comes as three foldables in one, and the first one shows the cross-section of the internal structures, two pages. Then we have the cerebral cortex with the different uh, cortical areas and association areas. Then we just have a really big one with um, the three different major lobes of the cerebral cortex. And that comes, all three of those come in the one foldable product, the one brain foldable product. Now you also have the nephron, two pager right here. You have the male reproductive system, which goes really well with what I showed you earlier on, the female reproductive system. And now we have some of the, the, the ones that are vertical. I'm not going to turn the, uh, the camera because it won't all fit, but here's the endocrine system. This is a two-pager and it's the eye and I also give a blow-up of the retina to go with the eye. This is the ear. Uh, this is a really useful one, the microscope. And here's the respiratory system with the overview, the alveoli, and then a close-up in uh, of one alveolar sac of the gas exchange that's happening. This one's the overview of the skin, with then a blow-up close-up of the layers of the epidermis. The next one is stuck, but this one's the skeletal system. As you can see, this one's all colored, three-pager, or I've also provided it as a two-pager if you want it to be a little bit smaller. This is the stages of mitosis, and I provide this with or without uh, prometaphase. And meiosis as well. Then you have DNA structure. DNA replication. And the last one is the digestive system. And as, as you can see, this one is slightly smaller than the others because this one, uh, I cut it out and I sized it specifically for a composition notebook. So this one would fit perfectly into an interactive notebook without overflowing the edges. And they all, all the other ones that you see, also come with that option. So you can fit them nicely into a binder or into an interactive notebook.